All right, welcome back to Metal Gear Solid. Can you talk? Who are you? I'm not one of them. <sighs> the DARPA chief told me he gave them his detonation code. What about yours? Oh, I get it. Jim sent you. You're from the Pentagon. Answer my question. What about your code? There's no time. I... I talked. What? Now the terrorists have both codes and can launch any time. It's not like I didn't fight. I managed to resist Psycho Mantis's mind probe. He couldn't read you? How'd you do it? Surgical implants in my brain. Surgical implants? Uh, kind of like psychic insulation. If this was Metal Everyone Gear Solid 4, they would not be implants, they it. would clearly be nanomachines. DARPA chief? Of course. But the DARPA chief said Mantis got his code by reading his mind. Are you sure you heard him right? Yeah. Anyway, how did they get your code? I... I never had any training on how to resist torture. <laughs> Uh oh, he's coughing up chalk. Uh, it looks like he had some fun with you, all right. He's not human. I tell you, he loved every second of it. What happened to your arm? He broke it. Mm, looks like you're more than even now. His was sliced off. I love that animation he does. Uh, you're a funny guy. So, the... the DARPA chief... Is he okay? Dead. What? It, it can't be. No, that's not what you promised, Jim. Now you want to shut me up. Ah. Calm down. <sighs> Kenneth Baker just hurt us more than Ocelot did in the last fight. What's wrong with you? I just told you I was here to save you. I didn't kill the DARPA chief. He had a heart attack or something. A heart attack? Oh, don't be a fool. Anyway, the terrorists have both codes now. Oh, those boys are totally insane. They wouldn't hesitate to launch. I agree. But what do they really want? Who knows? Maybe they're like us in the arms industry. Always looking forward to the next good war. Well, it appears Ocelot can't be in the arms industry anymore. Start a war today. Do you still have the card keys? Card keys? To override the detonation code. I heard you had them. No. Not anymore. What? Who does then? Not the terrorists. Uh, no, that 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 woman woman who the only woman on the base a snake soldier that was thrown in prison along with me prison that female soldier she said that she had just joined up as a new recruit they they threw her in prison because she refused to take part in the rebellion oh that one a i got confused recruit. could that be the colonel's niece i gave her the key Oh, looks like she managed to break out of here, though. I hope she's okay. I'm sure she is. She's green, but as tough as they come. But how did you know she escaped? I was in contact with her by Kodak. Until I was tied up here, that is. Kodak? Yes. She stole it from the guard. If she still has it, you should be able to contact her. I'm sure she has it. What frequency was she at? Oh, yeah. L let me tell you, it's... it's... Huh? Oh... Sorry. I forgot. Damn! <laughs> <laughs> this game is so oh, stupid sometimes. Right. It should be on the back of the package. 
try to contact her. I do like how they kept that consistent. You know, in the original game, it was on the back of the jewel case. If this doesn't and work, is there on this game, it's on the back of the, the, the GameCube launch. package, so it's pretty cool. You need to find Hal Emmerich, one of my employees. Who's that? Uh, the, the team leader of the Metal Gear Rex project. A uh, genius at engineering, but a little bit of an oddball. If there's anyone who can figure out how to stop Metal Gear from launching, it's him. What if he can't come up with anything? Well, you'll have to destroy it. Emmerich knows how to destroy Metal Gear. Where is this Emmerich? Well, he's probably being held somewhere in the nuclear warhead storage building. It's, it's north from here. That's where he worked. I understand, but why Metal Gear? The nuclear age ended with the turn of the millennium. Oh, you're wrong. The nuclear threat hasn't disappeared. The threat is more real than ever before. The amount of spent nuclear fuel in plutonium is increasing even today. Every time these Listen, games do something like this, I die a little bit inside. Because it's just so... No. I don't know, I, I just get the feel that it's like supposed to be just cheap. Like, this, this is all just, as you know, as as stock see, footage. Because there's still it's never really no been interesting. Way to use it or dispose of it. So they just close the lid and try to pretend like it'll go away? Uh, essentially, yes. And they're not even doing a good job of storing it. Many of the drums are corroded, with nuclear waste seeping out of them. Unbelievable. Not only that, several pounds of muff are reported every year. Muff? It stands for material unaccounted for. It proves they really that should there's get a, a better large acronym. and well-organized black market in nuclear materials. Furthermore, since the end of the Cold War, Russian nuclear engineers in particular are out of work with nowhere to turn. In other words, there's plenty of available nuclear material and scientists for making a bomb. We live in an age where any small country can have a nuclear weapons program. What about the other superpowers? The Russians and Chinese still pursue a policy of deterrence. Do you see? Complete nuclear disarmament is an impossibility. To maintain our own policy of deterrence, we need a weapon of overwhelming power. Yes, because Peace Walker worked out so very well. Mm, Metal Gear. Yes. You know our industry suffered quite a blow as a result of the cuts in military budgets due to this so-called peace I remember hearing a lot about mergers and takeovers among the big weapons makers. Yes, and after my company lost their bid to produce the U.S. Air Force's next line of fighter jet, the Metal Gear system was our last ace in the hole. That's why we pushed to have Metal Gear developed as a black project. Black project? Secret projects paid for by the Pentagon's black budget. You can avoid a lot of red tape and get a great lead time on your weapons production. And no one can bother you. Not even that bunch on the military oversight committee. Bribes. Just call it the military industrial complex. Anyway, Metal Gear was going to be formally adopted after the results of this exercise were analyzed. I don't give a crap about you or your company. Yes, that's about what I'd expect from a grunt like you. Here. This is what you came for, right? Holy fuck floppy What's disks. That? An optical disk. It's all here. The main hard drive was destroyed by gunfire. This is the only remaining copy of the data. What kind of data? All the data collected from this exercise. Don't play dumb. I know you were sent to get this. I hid it from that sadistic maniac while he was torturing me. Ocelot clearly did not do a very good job exists. searching him. Make sure that you report this to Jim. To your boss. I'll give you my card, too. It'll open up all security level two doors. Can you walk? No. 
You go on without me. Oh. They got my password. They don't want anything else from me. I have one more question. Who or what was that ninja thing? It looked like you knew something. Uh, that ninja? That was Foxhound's dark little secret. Dark little secret? An experimental genome soldier. <laughs> you know him? <laughs> you should ask Dr. Naomi Hunter from Foxhound. She knows better than I. Naomi? You've got to stop them. If it goes public, my... my company and I are... are finished! What? Doesn't Metal Gear use currently existing technology? Metal Gear itself does, but... Oh, 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 what? What did you do to me? Uh, oh, no! Oh, oh, no! It can't be! Those Pentagon bastards! So they, they, they actually went and did it! Oh. 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 What are you talking about? They, 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 they're just using you for... for oh. Oh. I don't know why every time one of these what characters the has to die in this game, they make the most ridiculous of noises. <laughs> and yet again, Snake is just baffled by the fact that people can die. Colonel, are you listening? Now he's dead too. Everyone I just keeps no dying. Idea. Don't lie to me. It looked like another heart attack, but... Some kind of poison? Well, there are lots of drugs that can cause a heart attack in large doses. For example, potassium chloride or digoxin. But we won't be able to tell without doing an autopsy. Damn! Snake, I want you and Meryl to work together. Can I trust her? More than you can trust me. Get in contact with her. Snake, there's a lot of electrical interference coming from there. It should be okay if you do burst transmission like us, but normal transmission is probably impossible. Try moving away from that area. Snake, get a hold of yourself. Naomi, what the hell was that ninja thing? A member of Foxhound? No. Are you sure? Yes. We have no one like that in our unit. Is that right? Snake, I'm counting on you. So now what we're going to want to do is, uh, oh hey look, holy shit, gameplay in this video, wow, don't get used to it, because right now we have to call up Naomi, we just have to uh, find her frequency, which like I said is on the back of the game box. That was wrong, because my controller is super sensitive. Alright, keep going, there we go. Who are you? I was really impressed with the way you busted yourself out of there. The one from the prison? You're the colonel's niece. Meryl, right? No, it's not him. Just exactly who are you? Hmm. I'm the fool that your uncle sent to this hellhole. You came alone? Trying to be some kind of hero? I don't need lectures. You're just like your uncle, you know? How do you know my uncle? We go way back. What's your name? My name's not important. Aha. Uh -huh. Could you be Snake? Are you Solid Snake? That's what some people called me. The legendary Solid Snake? You? Uh, sorry about before. I wasn't sure if you were one of the good guys. But I knew you were. How? It's your eyes. My eyes? They're not soldiers' eyes. They're rookies' eyes, right? No. They're beautiful, compassionate eyes. Snake, Just now is not the time to hit on her. Very solid snake. You're trying to sweep me off my feet? Don't worry. You'll land back on them once you meet me. The reality is no match for the legend, I'm afraid. I don't believe that. Why did you look so surprised when you saw my face? Because you look just like him. You mean the terrorist leader, Liquid Snake? Yeah. You know him? 
You're not brothers, are you? I have no family. I love how at this so point Snake deal, just then? thinks like, oh yeah, it's just a know. coincidence that I happen Maybe to look exactly like Liquid way. Snake, but first, and that Liquid I'm Snake takes my name and kind of you inverted it. From the like, what does he think? What exactly happened here? I just joined the training that same day. That's okay, but what is this place? I don't think it's just a nuclear weapon disposal facility. Boy, oh boy, it's just like them. Nobody's told you anything, did they? Okay. You see, this place isn't really for disposing nuclear weapons. This base is owned and operated by a dummy corporation of arms tech. This is a civilian base? Right. For the development of Metal Gear. Colonel. Foxhound and the Next Generation Special Forces were called here for the test launching of a dummy nuclear warhead. Why Foxhound? Because they're a special ops group used to handling top secret missions. They figured they could help keep it all hush hush. But they must have been test firing dummy warheads for a while. Why just this time? I heard it was because this was to be a final test before the formal adoption of the Metal Gear program. That's what I heard anyway. Uh, sounds kind of fishy. So what do you think the terrorists want? Sorry, I'm not sure. I was captured with President Baker right after the revolt started. Oh yeah. That's when he gave you the detonation code override keys, right? That's right. Amazing you were able to keep them hidden from the guards. Well, women have more hiding places than men. Anyway, you met Baker, huh? How's he holding up? Oh, he's, he's dead. dead. What? Heart attack. Same as the DARPA chief. I swear Did I'm not killing them. Heart attack too? Yeah. Was either of them sick or anything? No. Not that I heard of. Well, I don't believe in coincidences. Something funny's going on. Huh. Sounds like it. But I have no idea what. Me neither. Yet. Do you know the person who designed Metal Gear? You mean Dr. Emmerich? He should be in the research lab in the second floor basement of the nuclear warhead storage. Please don't say second floor basement. Second floor basement. God damn it, yeah, Snake. That's where his lab is. I think they're forcing him to work on the nuclear launching program. So they'll need him alive until that's done anyway. Then we'd better do something before he finishes. You're right. In case we can't override the detonation code in time, I need to ask him how to destroy Metal Gear. You plan to take that thing on by yourself, Snake? It won't be the first time. How do we get to the nuclear warhead storage where the doctor's being held? There's a cargo door on the first floor of this building. See, this is exactly the kind of information that's annoying. I've played this game so many times, I know exactly how to get there. I've got a level 5 card. Well, I've got to go save the doctor. You should go to the- I'm going with you! No way. This is not a co-op game, little girl. I want you to hide somewhere. I'm not green! Oh, yes you are. You pause for just one second in front of your enemy, and it's all over. Good luck doesn't last forever. I don't know what happened. I just couldn't pull the trigger right away. I never had any problems in training. It was frightening to think that with a pull of a trigger I could take someone's life. It's not like shooting targets in training. I always dreamed of being a soldier. Every day of my life, I've trained my mind and body for the one day when I could finally see some real action, and now... So what now? You want to quit? I can't quit. I can't allow myself to quit now. Listen, you're not normal if you don't feel something the first time you kill. Killing without guilt produces more carnage. In a war, all of mankind's worst emotions, worst traits emerge. It's easy to forget what a sin is in the middle of a battlefield. But this isn't a war. It's a terrorist action. You're just a little jumpy from the combat high. The adrenaline in your bloodstream is starting to thin out. Just take it easy. But I learned all about combat high at the academy. We'll talk about it later. For now, just think about keeping yourself alive. If I get out of here alive, I'll think about that other stuff. Okay. Let me try to say this another way. Stay the hell out of my way. <laughs> You're a real bastard. Just like my uncle said. Huh. I told you. The real me is no match for the legend. <laughs> Looks like you were right. <laughs> okay, <Snake. laughs> oh god, that is just such an awkward we'll dialogue. Grab the doctor. Hang on to the key until then. 
got you. But listen, I know this area better than you. Call me if you have any questions. Be careful, okay? After I open up the cargo door, I'll contact you. Oh god, so many goddamn cutscenes. Let's get out of this room. I just want it to end. Good god.